Is this pe- no. <laughs> I'm in the car. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> How are you? Oh, uh, Dave. Oh my God. It's been. Uh, I don't even know. Can I swear on this? Yeah. Show? Oh yeah. Like, you can, can say I- whatever the fuck you want. Honestly, like it's just been a long road for me for 13 years, man. I saw it. Uh, and um, I've had so many people rally around me. Uh, I don't know if you have kids. Um, I but don't, but I saw your story. It's the biggest nightmare that's ever happened to me, and it, it's my my little girl Alexa. You would have loved her. She was she was like like crazy. Like you know, she didn't care. Like if someone gave her a needle, she didn't like. She was just a monster like that. Like she was just so amazing and she taught me so much and i pulled over um i am just so i'm numb i'm numb i mean it's been 13 years of trying to put my life together trying to get it together with my restaurant and then covid it's like you know i've been getting kicked in the face for years and this is like the light finally is like shining down you know we were talking about, you know, it's, my place is old school. It's not necessarily a pizza place, but I have something called a pizza puff. And I was literally going to go with, like, the Portnoy and put yeah. it on the wall with, like, the rest of, like, you know, the Cal Naughton Juniors and the stuff like that. Um, but I am just so blown away by what you guys have accomplished in such a short period of time, helping so many people in need and really stepping up to the plate and making things happen. Yeah, uh, it, it, it's I never people ask me how to react on these calls. It's it's like people like you, stories like you. It, it, we're like the we have this platform, and you know I love I love our readers. I always have. I stood by, but they see the stories and they want to help. I mean that's it, it's like everyday people. Like you're probably like a barstool guy, and a lot of the people are helping. So we're just happy we can help and get stories like okay. yours. It's kind of a no brainer. Obviously, read the whole story, and you have. I mean talk about a shit run of luck so uh you know it's a it's a tiny something but we want to definitely help uh dave i i i can't thank you enough it's just been um it's crazy what's going on right now man honestly you know whether it's politics or this or that like people have forgotten to be kind to each other to love each other you know like we're all different but we're all the same I think that's kind of what has made this the the fun take off. It's there is what you there's so much like shit right now in the world, and it's so like you know everyone's pointing the finger and antagonistic. This is the only thing. Nothing matters. It shouldn't matter like politics, color skin. This is like we're just helping people, and that's I think why everyone's rallying. It's, the, it's like finally something good. That's just pure good. That's all this is totally. like getting the money, pure getting love. yeah right. So. And I, I think it's amazing, dude. And I love what you guys got going on. I, I've been a fan since day one. I love the one bite. Thank Even you. though there's six bites. Yeah. You know, like yeah, it, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You got to make sure you, you make no rash decisions. So Totally. Yeah. Totally. So I love it. Um, I, I'm glad we found you and reached out. Um, your story is amazing. And, and this is pretty quick. Like we'll get, uh, like we hang up, someone gets in contact with you within 72 hours. We'll have funds to you. And every month until, you know, Chicago opens up again, uh, we'll be there just to make sure, you know, at least for this part, you get through the other side. Amazing. I would love to meet you in person. I mean, I know that Northbrook's like a flip on the map from the entire country, but like. How far you know, away is that from downtown? Maybe 25 oh, minutes. That's easy. So. You know, yeah, I mean, a couple of my buddies, they know Waddle and Sylvie, like, you know, like, so, you know, anytime you're in Chicago, I'll even bring it to you. No, like, next time I'll, I'm going to be, I'll be in Chicago probably like early March for, for a while, for a couple of weeks. So I'll definitely stop by. I would love it, dude. When you got my number, you know where to find me. Yep. Same. You got mine. All right, dude. I appreciate you so much. All right. We'll be in touch. All right. Thanks, Dave. Take care. Bye. Bye-bye.